Okay. <laughs> uh, Warmly welcome in the Bolaton Sand and we from the biggest Hungarian student magazine. So, do you like the festival? Do I like the festival? Yeah, the area and the Bolaton Lake. Yeah, the lake is beautiful. Last time we, we played here, we had several days off, so we, we went around the lake and some people went water skiing and we checked out the local restaurants. Yeah, it's a really great location for a festival. And I'm sure you are not lonely here in the festival because you are always collaborating and have some friends. And what do you think? Who is the coolest guy now in the festival from the lineup? I, I don't know. I'm not sure who's on. I, I really wanted to see Hercules and Love Affair. I really dig what they do big time. I'm a fan of their music, you know, and really surprised to see the stereo MCs. They, they're a, a name from a long time ago that were very, very important in, in terms of the history of dance music. So this is the first opportunity I've had to see them in, in the flesh. Well, well we've always gone with, with, with the flow. We've always reflected contemporary trends right from the beginning when with the first album, Dub No Bass with My Head Man, was very contemporary and, and each album reflected what we were feeling as well as combined with what was going happening at the time. So when it came to the Barking album, Rick, who is my partner and the producer of all the records, was very clear that he wanted for the first time for those remixers and those other producers to work together with us as fellow collaborators and, and see what happened. There are so various artists, so it's from trends, drum and bass, house, oh my god, so it's a mix, this album is a mix. That's right, well our tastes have always been a mix up, you know, we've always had very eclectic tastes. I think that was the thing about the people liked about Underworld in the beginning, that was we took indie and we took techno and trance and we put them together with a bit of German electronics and, and those things combined made the sound of Underworld. So for us we, we like many different styles of music and many styles of dance music and we try and reflect that in the, our show. And do you have uh, own visual stuff? It goes back a long way with us. We have a, we, 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 we formed a company called Tomato uh, in the early early 90s that make beautiful visual works, you know. And for many many years, we showed their work on the big screens. We were one of the first dance artists to use big screens and projections on the stage. And now, for maybe the past six or seven years, we've worked with the same guy, a guy called Toby Vogel, um, who uses a lot a lot of live cameras, a lot of live editing. All the all the visuals are created live some some films that he's made generated for for our own work and this he's making work all the time so what you will see in terms of lights and video on the screens is all live and improvised uh, can you recommend something for the hungarian students like no drugs have fun or <laughs> <laughs> can i recommend something you know i mean i i don't think i'm a shining example to anybody because i've done most things that i shouldn't have done um, and uh, and stop doing most of them. Um, do you know, I just think uh, be happy and uh, just don't kill one another and don't kill yourself, you know, and, and just, <laughs> it's kind of pretty important stuff, you know, just just be happy and, and, and chill, you know, and just, there's plenty, plenty of fun to be had, but there's no need to be in a rush to do it. Okay, thank you so much. Thank you.